Yes, yes, Makaseme Kesemo, blessed love my people. Wagwan, love to each and everyone that you around the world, globally, wherever you are. Just give God thanks for your life, give God thanks for your life. They'll be watching this video, and this video blog is about the Grammys. Yes, you all know that uh, Julian Molly won his first Grammy, and uh, it's it's like yeah we 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 big up 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 and also big up to Beanie man big up to Buju Bantan big up to Burning Spears Calibud you know big up to the artists them because when I check out the about the Grammy nominations yeah how the process is trust me these artists who didn't even didn't win at least they were at the top. You know what I'm trying to say because to get to the to get to pick who is gonna win the Grammy, who is gonna be a Grammy nominated, it's a process. You know, it's a process. So one of the thing is now, throughout years after years after years after years, um, reggae fans, especially Jamaicans, as Jamaicans, always say, "Boy, why is it always a Mali win it, win it, win it, win it, win it?" But when you check out the process of it, right? When you check out the process of it. Trust me, people. Trust me. To know that you're going to have a board of people who don't really tune to reggae and dance or like that. You know what I'm trying to say? But they still have their vote count. There is about three different sets of people do voting on uh, Grammys. Right? Me and you can't vote. You know what I mean? Me and you can't go buy the record and vote. It's just no. You know what I mean? But we can help in the beginning by sales. You know, their sales have to be off the hook. You know, once the sales off the hook and then all of that, they get identified by who don't really know what I'm going because of numbers they watch. They watch numbers, right? So, <clears throat> Julian Marley, right? I, I see a couple of blogs and they're saying, ah, oh, just because he's a Marley win it. But at the end of the day, maybe yes, but... The, when I check out, everything is also to do with popularity. You know what I mean? Sometimes when an artist, when, when the voters are checking to who they're voting for and they see the names, most of the voters don't have time to go and Spotify, iTunes or YouTube or wherever to check out the artist's music or the artist's album that, that they're um, nominated for. You know what I mean? So... They don't check it. They don't see the name, know the name. All right, between Beanman. All right, check it out now. Between Beanman, Bojoband, and Burning Spears, Calibur, Julian Marley. Is it? The, the, the next big name would be Burning Spear, right? Would be Burning Spear. But Burning Spear name, name still can't outdo the Marley because Marley, the minute the name Marley. That Marley name is already so globalized in every yard, every home, every space shutter, everywhere. You know what I mean? It's already globalized. So for a Marley in there, you know what's 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 a nice thing to see? If there's two Marleys in the Grammy, who would win it? It's just that. You know what I mean? So that is one of the process, you know, popularity of, of who they know. You know what I mean? And we we'll get to find out again, the Grammys is something that you can't buy out. As an artist, your label can't buy out the vote because unless you go, unless you go, go find everybody that's do the vote and, and pay for them to do the vote because it's the vote count and the vote and their system show up when the, the vote made. You know what I mean? So congratulations again, Julian Marley, because I see Julian Marley on the road, people. He's everywhere, everywhere in Europe. Everywhere, everywhere I go to play at a festival, he's on the festival. You know what I mean? I'm even, I even got friends who live right on the road from me. They leave here and went to somewhere in Europe to watch a show to to a Damon and Julian, Julian Marley show, right? Julian Marley performs somewhere in Europe and they buy a ticket from here to go there to see that show. So that to show you that they, 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 he's putting in the work. So if he's not putting in the work, then <clears throat> obviously, you know what I mean? Big up to Beanie Man. But I still haven't seen Beanie Man at most of these festivals. I see Julian Marley. I haven't seen him at the festivals them. I see Beanie Man in UK and always the places where our, our people are and whatever. But I don't see him at the places where all the white people are and all the, 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 the people know who have anybody who have anything to do with voting and all of these things into all them Grammys and anything and whatever. I don't see. You know what I mean? It's just an example. But 
this is what I'm saying. Artists, them, I realize it's not a Grammy. Just continue putting in the work. Make good albums. You know what I mean? Good album and promotion. That's very important. Again, because even in the Grammy, in the Grammy outlet, in the Grammy book itself, that um, all the voters get, like who all the people who, who, who are going to vote, they get a booklet with everything in it with all the artists everything in it and <clears throat> if you check it out all the american artists have their own page you know what i mean but again again in that book you have to understand is a promotion is a promotion to hop in there you know when you put something up in the voters face so remember you know the voters gonna have to get the booklet you know they have to get the booklet to go through the booklet to know who they're gonna be voting who's up for to get vote for or what you know what i mean and then before we move to the next process so it's a voting thing it's not us normal out here who can vote and say yeah being a man for win it or yeah caliber for win it or what you know what i mean so people congratulate julian marley for win it at least i want to win it again remember remember about a year or two years ago when the, the white band won the reggae, reggae album, what happened? Eh? The whole of Jamaica vexed and a cuss whatever, whatever. But guess what? Grammys is what it is, is what it is. It's just that us, dancehall and reggae, we need to just put forward more our work, forward more, promote our work more and try to do more tours because what you need to understand again with tours again a lot of the artists dance all the reggae artists ain't on tour because of the money you know what i mean because of the money some what they don't understand especially in europe sometime in europe in europe if europe can pay for example ten dollar for you to do a show right england maybe pay you fifteen dollar twenty dollar maybe you know what i mean depends what you're worth you know what I mean? But Europe not going to find what England going to find, UK going to find to pay you. You get what I'm trying to say? It's different. And especially, again, in the UK, it, the London show is the most expensive show. So if an artist come to UK to perform, he can't charge, why more charge London price for Birmingham and he can't charge for Manchester? You know what I mean? London price and city price is different. So it's another process that you're getting. But that's not nothing to do with them. Grammys, is it? So again to the Grammys, congratulations Julian Marley and people remember this voting thing is serious. What Jamaican producers need to do, Jamaican producers need to do, they all need to register, get registered so they can get um get into the voting system, right? That's what they need to do. Get registered so they can get in the voting system and that is it. Big up Sly and Robbie them. Um, they are the first where we know about when the voting system. So people get into the voting system if you're a producer and all of that. I don't know exactly how these things work out, but it's up to you to find that out if you're selling records. You know what I mean? And that is it. So big up again. Love to all the artists that will be nominated. And big up to the winner again, Julia Marley. Big up being a man. Big up all of the artists them. Burning Spears, Cali Buds, Buju Bantan. Big up all the artists, eh, man. All artists continue to push the work because Grammys, it dead, you know. But yeah, we just get any more popular. You get me saying? And that is it. Big up on the same ones and all. Thank for the like, share, comment. Thank you for watching this video. At least, you know what I mean? We just processing, you know? We just processing. I remember we're not trying to downbeat no one right now. We are trying for sure to say at least we give thanks that somebody bring home the bring home the Grammy, you know. One of us bring home the Grammy. Julia and Marley bring home the Grammy for Jamaica. Thank you very much. Thank you very much because it's an embarrassment when Jamaica don't win the Grammy, you know. For reggae, you know. It's an embarrassment if Jamaica don't win the Grammy for reggae. So, big up all artists in Jamaica right now. All dancers and reggae artists. Big up on us. Big up every artist around the world. You know what I mean? But you have to you know when you have a tool and you realize you use a tool and somebody else take your tool and, and hit the jackpot. You're not going to feel good. You know what I mean? Real talk. So, <clears throat> big up every artist again out there in the world. But reggae and dance all artists push more. Let's push more. Continue push and push more. More promotion. Spend some more on promotion as well. Don't ever think it too big. Because you're out in the open world. 
people say, who are you? You know what I mean? So just keep promoting, keep promoting so you can win the Grammy there. All right? Big up everybody. Big up each and every one of you out there in the world. You don't know I'm a Jamaican abroad. You know? Maka se make se mo. As I can say, frankly speaking, do not beat me down. You don't know the thing go. A one life, you know, people. A one life. I want to see it go again. You know? So just live it and... Let's see how next one goes. Let's see how next one goes. But yeah, and and again, hmm, thinking about the Grammy again, Bojo would never win the Grammy. And that's simple. That's, it's not me saying it. It's just how they got it set, you know what I mean? Yeah, because his name is already gone down in history for something else. You get me? So it's not going to... No, 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 even for the cuckoo, for the fact that, you know, no, 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 no. But anyway, big up. You never know anyway. You never know. You never know. You never know. You never know. Is it? All right. Big up also. Keep back a pyramid. We won last year. Right? We keep back a pyramid, didn't it? Won the Grammy last year. Yeah. Big up. Big up. Big up. So, anyway, massive shout out. Big thanks, everyone. Thank you. I'm a Jamaican abroad. Remember, I'm not a professional in analyzing anything. I'm just saying what's what I see and what people are boring about. You know. Again, big up the Malis and Canadian popular. So I think you know what I mean. Enough love. Up, up, up.